For the last 13 years, the UK has been run by a conservative government. And for all of those 13 years, immigration has haunted them like a spectre. An issue they've always said they've had a handle on and just a moment away from solving. Going back to their 2010 manifesto when they stated, Immigration today is too high and needs to be reduced. And then to today, where Braverman's describing small boats as an invasion. For the Labour Party's part, they don't see immigration as an issue. They would prefer to increase the ability to immigrate in order to reduce dangerous trips made by small boats. But as the problem the Tories can't seem to solve has come to the forefront of British politics, it's dragged the country away from the centre, posing an issue for both main parties. First with UKIP and then with the Brexit Party, and now with Reform UK, there is an ever-growing part of the British public where immigration is their core issue. And it wouldn't be the first time an issue for many going unaddressed would upset the apple cart of mainstream British politics. So where do we go from here? A study from Oxford University showed that 44% of voters think that immigration needs to be reduced in some capacity, and only 17% of the country think it should be increased. And with 40% of the people saying it should stay the same, any party advocating for more immigration seems to be at odds with most of the population. And data from Unheard Britain shows the major parties all have a majority that think immigration levels are too high or they don't know. The most common point of contention for immigration activists is to call people that seek to limit immigration racist. And many are. But the same Oxford data from 2018 shows that when skill levels are included, there is very little difference in opinion when it comes to the nation of origin or race. I'm not advocating for a fortress Britain, where we live with no immigration in a British ethnostate. As far as I can tell, no one outside of the BMP, the English Democrats and the SNG are. But if the Conservatives don't get a handle on this problem, or the Labour Party don't change their approach to solving it, then the UK electorate will vote for someone that will. For now, that's looking like Reform UK, as they're the only party currently polling above 5% that stated outright they seek to limit the number of immigration, and with the only other party to state it wants to control immigration being the Tories, and the trust in them being at an all-time low. The next election may be the last chance for a moderate immigration plan. This has been a Chalkboard Politics video. If you've enjoyed, consider giving it a like, maybe even subscribe. Possibly come back for more.